desperately cold. Winter's coming. Check this out. But oh my god, just having my hand outside of the window is just ridiculous. And we're gonna go riding this. Uh, I'm excited to go ride, but I'm a little apprehensive, uh, being that uh, it's every bit of 34 degrees outside. So uh, I know, you know, I was working on the video three for the Galt series, uh, Hacky Gulch, and I promised you some catastrophe in that. But unfortunately, I lost all the ride video is not where it should be. It's gone. It's lost. I may have, I must have inadvertently deleted it. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to go out and ride some Hacky Gulch, so I have a little bit of video for that, for the uh, part three of the Galt series. It's got, it's got to happen. Unfortunately. It's brutal out, it's brutal. Yesterday, no crap, was 80, probably 80 degrees. And today it's dropped over, it's dropped about 45 degrees to 33 degrees. So we're definitely, we're, uh, we're bordering on freezing. It's, uh, it's, whew, it's gonna be tough to get used to. Uh, so anyway, and then, and then, and then, to make matters worse, I will likely be in the shade all day because Hackett is a very shady trail. Uh, but given that it is cold, I doubt I'll see much traffic out there, so it'll just be me. So I'm gonna make a quick run down and back, and then I'll have some video for my part three of the Gulch series, uh, Hackett Gulch, and uh, we'll see what happens. I can't promise I'm gonna be riding fast because it's so f cold. I'll try to suck it up and get some good riding in, but uh, no promises. A bit of a wimp when it gets cold like this. Anyway, we'll see you out there. What? I can warm up a little bit, hopefully. We'll ride down here. See what happens. I don't know if I can do this. Hands are already numb. Woo. When I got out of the truck, it was about 31. And uh, as I said earlier, it was 80 yesterday. So that's like almost 50 degrees of temperature drop overnight. I am not feeling this this morning at all. So we'll see, man. I'll tell you what, my brain's half awake because it's so cold. We'll go down here to hack it and see what's up. Some like old school, get your hands warm method here. Oh my God. So, as you can see, there's frost on like everything. Well, on some stuff, it's definitely cold. This is a terrible idea. Actually, it's hot, but not as hot as you think it would be. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get my hands warmed up here. We'll get on the trail a little ways, but I'll tell you what, man, it, this is this is pretty brutal. Oh, oh, that's it, right back here. Oh, man, I wish that sun would come out. We'll get on a little ways though. A lot of downhill. This thing probably flattens it out pretty good. Oh, it looks like they've gotten a lot of water up here. It's definitely washed out. Definitely washed out a lot. So, I don't know if you can tell, but like I said, this is a lot of just downhill into the gulch. 
and uh, I'm a little cold. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna fly down here. The faster I go, the colder my hands get. And I'm definitely being a bit of a wimp today. Yeah, definitely got some water up here. Not very often you see puddles. Man, look at these aspens though, it's so pretty. Washed up. I don't remember being all whoopy down here. Are starting to get a little chilly. Yeah, yeah this is about as fast as I want to go. <laughs> oh. oh man, the smell of those, the smell of autumn though. Woo! It's a little exhilarating. I'm pretty sure I'm just uh, it's really hard to put sentences together it's cold We'll see much traffic down here this, today. It is not a pleasant day. I'm the only one dumb enough to be out here in this the first cold snap that we've had. Squirrel.
this is a giant steep rocky piece of shit. Oh. Okay. Oh. Slippery. Let's try this. Let's try to get this without dying. This is about as far as we got last time where Chris broke his four-wheeler. Oh, hands are frozen. Shit, yeah, man. You all right? Yeah, I'm good. What happened? Yeah, halfway up that rock. Uh-huh. It cut out on me. Oh, no. power. Oh, no. Okay. Sorry, I, my battery died. I was like, it takes forever to get it out of this thing, but. All right, stand by, bud. Yeah, I was like, he's gonna be so far ahead of me. It took me like 10 minutes to change this stupid battery. Okay. You're only leaking a little gas. Yeah, I can't do that. <laughs> All right. Yeah, right there. That's what okay. right, I made it to. And it just, it just, nothing. Like, what the f Ah, it wow. breaks and starts <laughs> sliding, so that didn't work. Alright. <laughs> well, sir, this should be fun. Yeah. Okay, what do we do? Uh, get it tipped up and. Yeah, if we can get it rolled onto the wheels, then we can probably get her down. Crush me. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. It's fucked. Okay. So can we? Let's see where we're. Oh, I oh, wrapped my nut. Oh. <laughs> this thing. Oh. <laughs> well, fuck. I did not expect to come up here and see you up like that. I was like, no, I was like, I was good. I was good. I come right around, went right up. Yeah. Had uh, it not fucking cut out on me? Weird. Got a little oil down there in the uh, intake. <sighs> Luckily, uh, Chris's Leatherman basically fixes all things. Oh. <sighs> Is there a drain in this one? Oh, probably not. Wouldn't that be too easy? Probably not. I guess they don't want you to tip it right over on its head though, generally. There is a drain down there. Is there? There's a tube in the bottom. Oh, that's good. It's probably... Oh, that's hot. Is it? Hot oil. Hot oil! <laughs> there's fucking oil too. <laughs> or if there's any oil left in the thing. Oh, it's not a lot of oil. <laughs> this thing, what's this thing take, like 16 quarts? No. <laughs> it's only a half a quart. It'll be alright. Uh, there you go, bud. Uh, well, you've made your donation to the Hackett, Hackett Gulch Trail. Yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's good on the environment. Yeah, yeah. Shit will buff out. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are you going to do, man? Well, well, at least I didn't have to take the thing out. That's true. I'm glad you saw that thing on the bottom. Hmm. Now if she starts without us killing the battery. Yeah. yeah. Okay, this is how we fix it. <laughs> yeah. Old fashioned starting fluid. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, get it right in there, Biden. You probably need a cork. Oh. Well, at least 
least we know it runs on yeah. ether. <laughs> Do you have any gas in there? It's got some. You can just ride all the way back spraying that in your intake. Right? <laughs> you stand up and spray it behind me. <laughs> Steep. <laughs> Tell me to bail if I need to. You good? Fine. Fine? There we go. Keep her moving. I'd kiss the stone going right up through here. Does that make sense? Are you gonna go up it, huh? In Jeep style, dude. <laughs> you can just go up through there. So close. That's the reason I can't go. Oh! <laughs> All right. Can we get on the? F you good? No, we'll be all back. Okay. Okay, if I can keep throttle. Okay. Woo! Oh my god. <laughs> uh, Here, you want to roll backwards? I do, but I can't. Nice and slow. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, buddy. <laughs> you got a lot of oil in that bitch. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, so this is about the point where we kill the battery trying to get it started again and um, basically turn around. Now, as we get pointed back down the hill, of course, we've got to try to find a ride out, right? We've got to tow this thing out. Um, that's where things get even more ridiculous. So stay tuned. Always an adventure. Uh, it's a big ass tent. Well, things are looking up. Looks like we have a potential help vehicle. Um, like I said, that's a very big tent. Very top heavy. Very top heavy FJ. Yeah. Broken. <laughs> but you guys can go ahead, man. You guys got plans. I got tools and everything you need. Yeah. Well. We're just trying to get it back out now. Yeah. That's all. You want me to throw you out there to the, to the sign? It, it's up to you, man. I, 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 you there. Yeah. Saturday afternoon, it's very likely that there will be many people coming. Not going to say no. Yeah. Okay, you guys, you sure? No, buckle up. Uh, so the thing about uh, front IFS is uh, 
lack of stability. Mm, not a lot of articulation. Mm -hmm. This could get really ugly. Not a great, not a great spot to turn around. Uh, would have felt terrible if what was about to happen actually happened. Uh, the guilt. I would have taken off and just left Chris there on his own. Oh, Jesus, watch this. Oh, Jesus. Oh my God. hard stop dude <laughs> Well, anyway, at least we ended the day on mostly a positive note. That guy didn't flop his FJ over, which, like I said, the guilt would have been tremendous. Like, hey, can you help us? Oh, sorry we ruined your life. But we got to ride out. Probably leave it, uh, leave the video there. I'm sure we've all seen stuff get towed off of trails before. But uh, this guy's a super nice guy. Uh, we appreciated his help. And definitely appreciated him not flopping his truck over <laughs> all right guys uh, thanks for watching sorry that that wasn't a more um, successful trip but uh, next time promise you we'll have to get back out there and uh, get a good video of this one of my favorite trails whether in a Jeep or on a bike this has been uh, it's been an awesome awesome ride button it back up and then it won't start again like and then now the battery's dying and okay. yeah. yeah i got a we're gonna be camping tonight so we got plenty that's a big tent too king size king size i got the the two person i, I guess a two and a half person one yeah. look at that Whew. it's beautiful i feel like i'm definitely gonna die right here though Absolutely slippery out. Stopping is a, definitely a bit of a nightmare. Man, that uh, slab is really steep. It's really hard to uh, appreciate it with these, with this camera. It really does flatten everything out. God, my hands. Okay, pull it together. These rocks are super slick this morning too. It's weird. Some kind of black ice. Chilling out, riding chilled. My hands are frozen. It's hard to though. You just want to get on it. Oh. Ugh, puddle. <laughs> Last thing I want is cold, wet drops of water hit me in the back of the neck.
god. Holy cow, my god. time real quick oh I got five miles to get back to the truck okay. that was fun for the mile that I went Man, this worked surprisingly well okay it feels great to be back in the truck my hands are warm again Heat's cranked up, starting to feel like a human again, not a popsicle. But thanks for coming along. That was a fun ride. It was short. It couldn't have been any longer. I couldn't have dealt with it. It was it was rough. <laughs> it was definitely rough. But uh, thanks for thanks for tagging along with me. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, definitely don't feel bad about subscribing. That'd be awesome. Uh, I'm trying to hit that thousand subscribers someday. And I'm probably gonna go home and dip my hands in lava for a little while. All right, bye.